How are y'all doing? This is uh, Phil Johnson, Phil the Grill, the owner of Trap House Barbecue, Phoenix, Arizona. I'm with Green Mountain Grills today, and I am going to show you how to smoke a short rib on the prime ledge. So let's get down and dirty with this baby. What I'm gonna do is show you real quick of what I do to prep my short rib before I put it on the smoker. You see a lot of this uh, silver skin and fat. You wanna get really a nice sharp knife, more like a fillet knife, and then just kind of get right underneath and just trim to get that nice, good marbling. If you cook regular pork ribs, spare ribs, there's a membrane on the back. I leave that on because what happens during the cook, that's gonna actually protect the bone and keep the bone together in this slab of meat. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a little bit of uh, olive oil, any kind of oil. This is kind of some uh, butter because I want my seasoning to adhere to the meat. And what I'm gonna use today to season up my beef is my rub. It's an all-purpose fill the grill rub, rub me all over. I'm gonna use a loot and booty jalapeno garlic black rub. And what this is gonna do, it's going to give me that salt and pepper and garlic flavor that I wanna get onto the uh, beef. We'll put that on the smoker. I got this ledge right here, prime. We got this one set at 225. I'm gonna put it there for about three hours and come and check it. All right, so while I got that short rib on, I wanna make this incredible sauce that I really feel that complements short ribs. What I got here is some nice Guinness stout, baby. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a half a cup of this Guinness stout in a uh, pot and then start anise. I'm gonna put this in here, just one. And basically what I wanna do is boil that down to where it's nice and uh, starts thickening up on you, you know? I'm gonna take the star anise out. We're gonna add about two cups of ketchup, about a quarter cup of apple cider vinegar, about a quarter cup of honey, and we got some mustard. Look at what I'm getting here, a nice, dark, stout. The aroma is just crazy right now. I'm gonna just put that right back on the smoker and let that thicken up. Look at that nice bark. The, uh, Fill the grill rub, make that mahogany color underneath. I love what it's looking like right now. It's almost done, it's almost there. I'm gonna just wrap it up with a little brown butter and I'm gonna put that right back on the uh, smoker. All right, so we got this at the temp we want, 202. Take this baby out, open it up, see what we working with here. Ooh, look at that jelly! Cause jam don't shake like that. Remember that? Guinness stout sauce that I made. I just want to get that nice and tacky. So I'm gonna just hit that. Ooh, look at that stout, look at that sheen. Set back into the ledge at 275 degrees for 10, 15 minutes. All right, let's get this short rib out. Mmm. Sauce is nice and set. Woo, that's looking good for me right there. So what I try to do is just kind of cut it on a diagonal to try to give everybody the same cut. Uh, all right, I gotta cut a little piece. Uh, that's good stuff right there. Green Mountain Grills does it every time. <laughs>